Uh, my name is Rui Falacha, I'm from Portugal. Uh, I live in a city in the middle of Portugal called Coimbra and my field of expertise in dentistry is uh, I'm a prosthodontist who loves composite resins. Prosthodontist is someone who takes care um, of the patient from the tissue regeneration, bone regeneration, uh, soft tissue regeneration to implant placement and rehabilitation over implants and teeth. I also add to that the love for composites, so I've been doing a little bit of everything in relation to oral rehabilitation. So I'm an oral rehabilitator. Of course, digital dentistry is mainstream now, um, but I think that we look at digital dentistry focusing on CAD CAM dentistry, but that's not digital dentistry. We believe that digital is much more than CAD CAM. Digital is um, every time we use technology to help us in our clinical practice. Clinical managing software, clinical managing applications, all of those is helping dentists be more efficient and giving treatments to the patients that are more um, standardized and that are more efficient too. We are getting very evolved in dentistry, but we also need to get back to the basics. And I think that in the next five to 10 years, we will realize that we have big advancements, but we have to take care of basic concepts, basic things like prophylaxis, like adhesion. Of course, I do research on adhesion, so I, I, I think that's very strong. We have to get back to the, main, the, the basic principles in order to do digital or not dentistry in a high level. I believe that in the next five to ten years, digital scanners will be standard in our, our clinics, such as, for example, ten years ago, digital radiology was not standard, and now it is. I see we will focus on high-quality treatment to patients, um, trying to get a minimum um, cost for, to ourselves. What I mean is, is I, I think we, we will focus, uh, because it's a worldwide trend, um, over the markets, we will focus on efficiently uh, managing our clinics so that we can um, efficiently give treatment to patients in, with better quality and, and more standard patients. And I think we will, in the next five years, we will even focus even more on being conservative, on preserving and saving teeth. I, I, in my clinical practice, I see that each day I extract less teeth and I have techniques and instruments that allow me to preserve teeth and to rebuild them and very successfully. The, of course, the LMR kit, uh, kit, we all know it, it's very good in terms of restorative dentistry, but then I felt in love with the handles, with the ergonomics, it's much easier to work with them. So I decided to get to know the rest of the LM products. And uh, the second product I used was um, Universal Correct. And it changed my life. I was doing um, scaling and it was so easy. Then I tried the, the Denton excavator and I, I, I didn't have to do any pressure to use it. It was fantastic. LM developed the, the DTS system, which is a huge difference in, in, in clinical and process manage, management. So uh, I, I, I started knowing the system and the, the, the possibility of knowing my stock, of knowing my materials, of always tracking everything, knowing which material I used in which patient, it gives me a clinical safety and a clinical predictability that I didn't have before. But especially what for me is more important, and that's my personal opinion, is being able to track everything I do to a specific patient. I have everything RFID tagged, I can know what I use in each patient. And that makes my clinical practice much more standardized and predictable.